Hi, and welcome to this test prep skill video covering strategies for solving questions on standardized tests such as the SAT, ACT, GRE, MCAT, and DAT. My name is Matthew, and I'll be your learning guide for this question. Which of the following ex is equivalent to the above expression? Whenever you see a question that says which of the following, you know that you're going to be looking at the answer space. When you're looking at the answer space, you want to see what's the same and what's different. Notice all of the answers have 24x squared in them, but some have a 1, some have a 4, some have a 20x, and some do not. Because you're looking for similarities and differences, it helps you to know what to do. The slow way to approach this problem is to try to multiply everything and then FOIL. This is slow, it takes too much time, we want to reduce the amount of time that it takes you to answer a question like this one. So by identifying differences in the answer space, it helps draw your attention to figuring out what to do. Notice that 4 times 1 times 1 is 4. That eliminates a couple of answer choices. That means that A is out and C is out. We're down to B and D. Now if you have any experience multiplying binomials, in this case there's always going to be three terms, but just to confirm that, 3x times 1, and then you have 2x times 1. This gives you 3x plus 2x, which is 5x, and when you multiply by 4, that gets you the 20x. So we have confirmed that letter D is the correct choice. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring the bell to be notified when my latest instructional videos are posted. To learn more about how you can accelerate your learning, visit my website, tutoringbymatthew.com, and schedule your lesson today.